Hi, this is Sam the Old Man, and uh, you may have just downloaded South Park Phone Destroyer, and you've discovered if you go in here to PvP Fights, and let's let that load up. There we are, and then we go um, across to the left hand side. We've got Butter's Gift Shop, and if you click on more stuff, here we are, more stuff loading up. Here we go, here we go. You can buy packs, but you don't have any of the South Park money yet. So if you scroll down, you can use money to buy coins. But down at the bottom here, you can use your real money to buy chests of cash. And look at them wobble around. Wobble, wobble, wobble. Stop! Stop! Everyone stop! Don't buy that yet. If you're brand new to this game, you've only probably just played for a day and you're thinking, I'll just buy a bunch of cash and we'll buy those card packs. I'll get myself some rare and cards uh, and epic cards. Stop, stop. You're going to regret it. Um, and I'm going to tell you why. For, for first of all, you might think going right across to the very right and buying the purple pack with three guaranteed cards is the best deal. And maybe it is, maybe there's some extra behind the scenes stuff to get better cards out of that pack. But at face value from what they've told us, buying three of the $700 packs, 700 times three is $2,100. Okay, that's a far better deal um, than the 2,500 pack because I'll, I'll tell you why. You get 15 cards. 3 times 15 is 35 cards. So same number of total cards. You're guaranteed at least 4 rare in the gold pack. Whereas in the purple pack you're guaranteed at least 10 rare. But 3 times 4 is 12. So you get more rare cards out of 3 gold packs. And finally you get 1 epic pack in gold. And 3 uh, epic in purple. Uh, that's the same. And then finally you get 700 coins uh, versus 2,000 coins. And 3 times 700 is 2,100 coins. You get more coins out of the purple pack. Uh, sorry, out of 3 gold packs you get more coins. So still, on almost everything, the gold 3 gold packs is either equal to or better. The only thing where that's not true is with the upgrade items. And you're getting 3 times 15 is 35 upgrade items instead of 65. But uh, for just 150 extra uh, dollars there, adding your to making your total 2,250, still less than the 2,500, you can get an additional 35 upgrade items and an additional 500 coins. So there you go your best value at least at face value of what they're telling us about these packs is three gold packs is better than one purple pack or and especially three gold packs and this brown pack over on the left hand side is better than one um, purple pack now Someone may prove us wrong by making a video of buying a purple pack and buying three gold packs and showing how awesome the purple pack is and how they got, you know, three epics and two legendaries and, and the best cards in the game. But at least from what we know about the cards, three golds is better. And stop, stop, don't buy it yet, stop. There's more. Okay, let's let's close out of out of the the shop first, and we scroll across to the right. Whoops, that's my phone. Hold on. <laughs> no, do not upgrade. <laughs> okay, so grab it and scroll across to the back to the arena here, and click the little eye on the arena. There we go. And while that loads up. This is going to show you what cards that you have access to, and this is based on PvP levels. I'm at level 12, so I've unlocked level 10, but when we start, here we go, at level 1, here's the cards you have access to. You can click the card down the bottom, it shows you, and it'll bring up and show you what it is. Here it is, that Space Warrior token. Tap to continue. Um, while it loads in, can I click the cards that I don't have yet? 
nope it says what does it say it says not owned open packs to find this card so when you get packs you will unlock these cards and if you're a level one you're going to get something from this pack so all of your epic cards will be out of these level one stand backyard cards once you get to level five you get a whole bunch more and they're cool but still um, most of the good cards are not in the game yet you I've got to level 10 so I'm getting a whole bunch of these green cards and and other great cards here but but there's a but we've only just begun the game and I have like really I there's no reason to to need to buy cards yet because I'm still progressing at quite a fast rate level 15 uh, and then right through level 20 there's even more cards and then once we get to level 25 it's just two cards and then 30 there we go it's just two cards and then 35 is one card 40 is two cards and then as we move on uh, there's there's no more cards at least at this stage I don't even know if those levels are in the game yet but what I do want to say there is wait at least as a very minimum to get to level 20 ideally if you can level 25 before you go ahead and buy the packs now man bear pig card unlocks i believe at level 10 is man bear pig in there can you see him yes in the top right hand corner of these cards this one over here uh that's man bear pig um great card to get he unlocks at level 10 here but as i said uh, there is going to be even more and better cards uh, that you're going to want to be able to get access to. So try and get to level 25, at least level 20, before buying those packs. Before that, you're really not getting your maximum value for money out of, out of this purchase. Um, and really, you can just play PvP and play through the story mode and just repeat, like farm through the story mode a few times to, to get your upgrade items and level up. And you shouldn't have too much of a problem getting to level 20 or 25 without spending any money whatsoever. And and really, like if you're bypassing like and skipping the game, like what's the point of buying the cards anyway? So wait till you're level 20, at least at a very minimum before buying those packs. You're probably gonna watch some YouTubers like Jay Gray, BKK, do really cool um, pack openings. But if we close that and go across to the guild, hold on, what's happening? Is it going across? There we go. And we look over here on the right hand side, Jay Gray, BKK is at level 21 now. So he's either gonna do them now or wait until he's level 25, but we'll find out um, when he posts his, his pack opening videos. But still, um, our guild, the member berries is full right now. Uh, there may be room later on, check if I can donate, nope. There may be room later on if people don't participate, if they quit the game. But for right now, uh, there's, there's a lot of zeros in there. Uh, and zeros might not get to stay in there for very long, but we'll, we'll give them time because, uh, as you can see, zeros and new to the game people probably don't have any of these cards that people are requesting. Look at that. Kelonois is requesting a card that is nothing, so <laughs> how do I even know what it is? But that's not the point. The point is stop and don't spend your money yet. Buy those packs. Uh, when when you um, reach those higher levels with the exception of if you need more upgrade items buying for 150 coins buying 35 upgrade items that's a pretty decent deal pretty decent way to get those upgrade items as well if you don't want to farm them or if you're stuck farming for some reason and you just can't get further which is ridiculous because like there's so much farming to do you should be able to really should be able to hit level 20 pvp just from from farming and playing through story mode um but if you really get stuck and you need to upgrade to progress you can spend money on the that brown pack 
and you are getting value that absolutely you are getting value out of that even at the lower levels uh, maybe even especially at the lower levels when um, you're going to get only the items that like if you're at level one and you want to get lots of level one cards upgraded then yeah go for it you'll you'll get lots of level one upgrade items but uh, yeah so if 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 you need to i just bought one unfortunately the video sounds screwed up i've i've fixed my sound issues now i'm back to to good sound so um that's that's the only one that i would suggest buying and so that's that's the recommendations whoops i clicked the phone just remember stop stop just pretend that more stuff thing is it isn't even there and actually while we're here i've got enough um coins to get both of these silver epic cards are they epic i think they are epic S save up your pvp coins we're gonna get them right now let's get the awesome o4000 buy one of those charge freezes nearby enemies with a cosmic stomp by look how much health it has that is a decent um very decent little uh card right there close that one only buy one don't buy two and then here's another one who we got here we have Hermes Kenny I'm gonna buy that as well death wish double energy gain for two seconds well that's pretty decent that's two seconds that's gonna get you one extra energy when he dies so he costs three which means he sort of only costs two but you have to like bank it and you don't get it till he dies which is not bad at all not bad at all or is the one energy per second maybe it's worth two energy and then he's really just worth one and that is fantastic but for i'm gonna buy that too because i don't have it i, I don't know if I, I don't know i'm not gonna say whether this is good or not but i just wanted it now there we go there we go so there's the advice stop don't spend money just play the game and uh once you hit level 20 to 25 if you want to get up in the pvp matches go ahead and buy packs then wait until then that's my advice for you i hope uh, that helps you out i'm sorry if you've already purchased uh, in this game but really uh you really couldn't wait if you've already purchased uh, but if you have infinity dollars and then by all means purchase a purple pack every single day in fact why not purchase one every single time you open the game because you have infinity dollars um but if you have less than infinity dollars you probably want to wait to level 20 or 25. Um, i'm just guessing but you probably don't have infinity dollars uh yeah that's that's i'm pretty pretty safe bet i'd say all right thanks for watching I hope that helps, and I will see you with another episode another day. Maybe even today, because I love this game. I can't put my phone down. See ya.